I'm in a lot of pain today. <laughs> Not as much as I have been over the last few days, though. Uh, I think walking actually might have helped a little bit, like, um, moving my joints around a little bit more. Um, so what we're finding, what we're finding, this is my end of day recap. I shared a beautiful sunset photo, right? Because, um, I was given two turfs. And so one of the turfs was on the cliff side, like the beach side of Coast Highway. And the other one was on the hilly steep side. And I tried the first one out first because it's more working class. And so I figured I'd probably have more success on that side of the street. And I concluded the day in the rich side of town because it's flatter terrain and my body hurt, right? But I also uh, had the opportunity to go for about an hour and a half, maybe an hour, hour and a half, um, to uh, try and get signatures at the farmer's market. And um, while most of the people who I got to sign petitions were not actually Laguna Beach residents, they were Orange County residents, I was able to work on the other two petitions. And so it really put me ahead in that particular area with like the getting registered nurses into dialysis clinics and getting pandemic relief um, at the state level so that we have more autonomy. I, it feels like my numbers are low, but Bridget did reassure us both. There was only a couple of us walking today that um, we're producing good numbers. It's tough. Laguna is tough, y'all. <laughs> Laguna is tough. Um, I did get a beautiful sunset photo. Um, I was supposed to go pick up my tamales tonight. I'm so sorry, Beatrice. My body hurts. I've taken uh, some things, um, you know, over the counter, like Tylenol. <laughs> like normal stuff. I've taken some normal stuff. And um, <laughs> just trying to rest up my body right now, y'all. I think the weather change, because it's starting to get a lot cooler than it has been, plus, like, just stuff with my anatomy um, has really just made it really hard on my body. Like, I'm, I'm not, I've never, I did a desk job from 98 through 2020. I did a desk job. And now everything I do is physical. Everything I do. And I was already experiencing like joint deterioration and issues from having a desk job. Right. So like the first ailment I discovered was like two years into my desk job, somewhere around like 99, 2000, I started having hip problems from sitting all day. <laughs> you know, and, um, then the knees started going and now the ankles are going and it's like, <laughs> <laughs> just falling apart. I am pushing 50. I'm doing the best that I can. And I'm also probably perimenopausal. Um, I'm, yeah. Oh, my body hurts, y'all. My body hurts. Um, also was bummed out that I missed uh, TJ Shaman went live again today, but he was doing it while I was walking. I got the notice, but like, I can't, I can't play music while I'm trying to talk to rich people on the coast. <laughs> can't have my hip hop going while I'm talking to rich people on the coast. Um, Beatrice wants me to come sing karaoke and I told her straight up my body hurts too much. I can't, like, I can't, I'm, I'm already in fleas, y'all. <laughs> I'm already in fleas. I can't. Uh, I might sing at home. I might do some singing at home. Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. And since we've no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Ah, uh, okay. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna try and nurse my body because I gotta do another eight hours of walking tomorrow. <laughs> Do another eight hours of walking tomorrow, y'all. Um, I love having these conversations. I love how I have, I meet some of the most interesting people, but yeah, I told 
I told my team lead the other day, my two biggest fears are I'm going to be assaulted or um, I'm going to take a slip on the trail because my joints are failing me. <laughs> Either one of these things are a very real possibility. Um, but usually I'm able to talk people down. Like I, the only moment that was really scary for me was when that one dude got totally belligerent on me and slammed the door in my face. But I'm glad he did it that way and didn't freaking chase me because that's happened too. I've been chased before, but fortunately, like I was ahead. This is so scary too, because I can't run. <laughs> I can't, my joints are too bad. You guys, my joints are too bad. I can't, if somebody was to try and chase me down, I'd be so screwed. I'd be so screwed because I can't run. <laughs> I, can't, I can't run. I would be so screwed. I love walking in daylight hours so much more than having to do the nighttime hours, you guys. But I love having these conversations. I really do, though, at some point. Like, I've thrown this out there. I really want to learn more about, like, how these data systems work. I want to learn more about, like putting somebody's walking down there with a flashlight. Mm. I want to learn how to put together the universe. I want to learn like the, I want to learn the data side because I'm going to need that knowledge ultimately, right? I will need that knowledge ultimately. Um, if I'm going to keep helping campaigns and stuff, like I can't just be the, the person who knows how to like have the conversations. I need to be the person who actually knows how to manipulate the data too. Like I need to be the person who knows how to put together the universe. And I'm never going to have that knowledge if y'all don't put me in a role where I can have that knowledge. I could be really good at it. <laughs> I promise you I'm very good at IT systems. <laughs>